yeah! Check this shit out with my drummer. Oh, hi. Tom's shoelace is untied. Watch this shit in front of 15,000 people.
Dude, your fucking whiskers all your whiskers all over my face. You grab my dick so gnarly on that. I'm sorry. There's a point where the show is its own thing. You know, you brought some secret shit into the show that was supposed to be. I went in for the bro hug and you rubbed your fucking but horny ass whiskers thought, across my face. To be honest, I thought if my whiskers touched your cheek, that was enough. But you went <laughs> straight for the fucking dick and that caught me off guard. I'm just gonna say it. He's so gnarly. Wait till I visit your hotel. Part of your ticket price, shitheads. Oh, I need a guitar. The Jesus. guitar. Travis and I start this song. Here we go. good on the next song when he plays his drums your ovaries are gonna drop for the first fucking time
say the girl just a kind of but she wanna kick and scream all along. You wish she would stay. Fuck the guy that took her in away. I think if at one of the hotels that we're staying at, if they have a steamer, like a really nice handheld steamer, we could steam um, the ambulance because it looks a little wrinkled. I was thinking something new that could do as a team. You know, it's got wrinkles in it. I'll do it. Here's a new song. I know, I know. I feel the this same way about, about bands that play a new song. Who's awesome. heard this one? Don't you know? 
There's so many good looking girls out here. Jesus Christ, what's in the water? Oh, you guys are hot. Way more than Cleveland. What? Oh, the guitar? If there's anything that we know in a rock band, we understand the female body. We are like biologists and geneticists. We can spot a really hot girl from thousands of miles away. We smell it in the air. We're really good at it. I'm still searching for the female prostate. I'm gonna find it. You know what I love about- It's out there somewhere. Mark, what? You know what I love about what? the clitoris? I love how it gets long and the ovaries hang down low. And if, and if you just do this to the clitoris, it gets bigger. That's what I like about it. Should I get the guitar and shut up? Hi, we're Blink-182 from California. Yeah. This is what we do. Tom was right, by the way. This song is for you. Loose cynical feelings saying I should give up. Said anything you'll ever say. There's a moment of panic when I hear the phone ring. Anxiety's calling in my head. Is it 
song entirely in the dark. Just like how we fuck your mom in the fucking dark. It's Christmas Eve, baby, we're at two fucking places. It's Christmas Eve, baby, we're at two fucking places. And I hate, hate, hate you, guys. I hate, hate, hate you, guys. I'll never talk to you again. Let your girl suck me. I'll never talk to you again. Let your mama touch me. I'll never talk to you again. Let your lady touch me. I'll never talk to you again. Let your lady touch me. Besides Elton John, oh maybe he doesn't even hear. Hey Mark, when you're backlit, the way your hair is and your glasses, you look fucking great. You look like you've lost weight. You're in shape. You look fucking great. Yeah. It's a burden more than a gift to have the perfect Adonis body. This is what peak fitness looks like, people. Hey, you want to know what else is great about you? Back in the day, we would play places like this, and there was a communal shower, and Mark's got a pretty big dick. For real, you seen it? He was blessed. Put up those lighters and cell phones. I want to set a vibe. Hurt their feelings, Tom. To wake up when the shades have been pulled shut. This house is haunted, it's so pathetic, makes no sense at all. I'm right with things to say, but the words right and fall away. What stupid poem could fix this home? I need it every day. It's my ease, but not 
That one fucking song. gets me. Wait, don't talk over me. Shut the fuck up, Tom. I'm okay. being sentimental. My bad. Sorry. That Go one ahead. gets me. Hey, what are you saying? That's it. What we'll did tell you another story later. What the fuck, Tom? Don't talk over I me. I don't hear what Fine. you're don't saying. Talk. You have what did you say? Hey, look, you guys, Mark, he's feeling like nobody likes him. There's insecurity dwelling within his heart. Cheer for Mark. You see, they like you. I know, stop it. What did you say earlier that I didn't understand? Jesus Christ, I said that song gets me in the feels. That's it, that's all I said. But I was stupid. That was it. That was a weak moment of you. <laughs> you gave your heart out there. That was stupid and weak. Only little girls do that. But this next song is about fucking and tasting and fucking and touching. It's called Always. <laughs> Are you? 
turns into a sex dungeon. <laughs> Tom won the contest. Tom won the coin toss on who got to towel Travis off during the show. I fucking lost. I called tails. It was heads. Tom got to towel him off. Mark, if my life depended on it, like my life seriously depended on it, would you give me... Yes. A bubble bath, calamine lotion, all over my naked body, lubriderm on my dick, fingers in the butt. Would you do that for me to save my life as a friend? I would do it if it were a cloudy day. Oh, that's a fucking friend, you fucking per per. That was funny to me. Come on! <laughs> Thank you. 
shit so fucking good. We started in a fucking garage and we get fireworks and shit. This is fucking awesome to have lights and fireworks. Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. Our drummer is levitating with anti-gravity. This is fucking radical. Mark, did you ever expect that? Uh, I deserve this shit. Here I fucking go. earned every penny. This is, I, this was, I was born for this shit. I deserve, I deserve everything. You were born to rage, motherfucker. Fucking love tonight. Watch this shit. You want to know how professional I am at being one of the front men of this band? Watch this shit. Pittsburgh, it's been a long time, and you know what? 
I missed you. I wrote this next song uh, about 20 years ago when I was really, really down, having a hard time, and uh, felt like I was near the end. And uh, it was not very long ago that I felt that way again. 
I was hooked up to chemotherapy machines, and I couldn't even walk up the stairs of my own house. I had so little energy, and I felt like I was near the end again. And then people found out that I had cancer, and I was really nervous about people finding out that I was sick. And once it got out, I was overwhelmed with all the love and support from complete strangers in the world. Both had liked our band, and had never heard of our band. And it reminded me that tomorrow does hold such better days. So this song is for all of you. Thank you for being here tonight. I love you all. I like breaking down in front of 15,000 people. I appreciate you. You made me cry. I literally 
got killed. I was fucking pissed. I was good until he did that speech, and then I got tears, and I was like, fuck you for making me look stupid. But then I was like, fuck, this is emo shit from the punk rock 2000s, so I'll do what I want to fucking do. When I was growing up, I was obsessed with ghosts, UFOs, weird shit. This song's for you. Take it away, Travis. Here we go!
you're so fucking good at what we do. You can't do what we do. We do shit that you This is the last see. song that we're about to play. This is like Einstein. You're right, it's not the last song, but we're gonna act like it anyway. Took her out, it was a Friday night I walk alone, to get the feeling right We started making out, and she took down my pants But then I turned on the TV I laughed about the time she walked away from me The Friday that she made me 23 Just a moment, these were TV shows What the hell is in the TV? What's the age you let me? What's the age you get?
Two more. Let's give him what for, huh?
Come from, where did you go? Where did you come from, Katnado? Where did you come from, Katnado? 